lost in the four eight minute game. So the fact you're up 12 doesn't mean it's over. What was it stopped like then? Uh, just to keep playing together, keep swinging the ball, and get touches. That's, that's the biggest thing. Coach um, always harps on just everybody getting touches. And second half, that's what happened. We came out, everybody was being aggressive. Everybody touched the ball. And I'm not sure how many assists we got, but I know it was pretty high. So the other part of this is the fact that this offense is the highest scoring offense. It's the all-star break. And I know that's not the only thing you guys are striving for, but what's working in allowing that to continue? Yeah, I think it's just um, swinging the ball. We got different people that can score the ball. Obviously, um, Trey and John are leading us in the scoring areas. But as you can see, Kevin, is, he's been hot lately. Um, that's very high. And he's, everybody's just getting touches. I mean, even Vince, and he's the oldest, oldest guy. He can score whenever he wants. So I think um, we play as a team um, we're pretty hard to guard. The Memphis team that we saw in October isn't who we saw tonight. The Memphis team that was 2-14 and 14 in January wasn't tonight because they had won 4-5. or five. Are you surprised at how good the start was for us in, in building this league? Yeah, I mean, I think we can play against just about any team in this league. We proved that this year against some of the top teams. So we're not really worried about the opponent. We're trying to just come out and play our game. and. Uh, tonight we played our game and had a, a great offense tonight, but uh, I think defensively we lost. When so we think of one particular play of uh, this game, you come up with a steal and you're going to 360, not in practice, not in a drill, but in an NBA game. At what point during the drive is that going through your mind? Yeah, I mean, once I got the steal, I was just thinking about um, which dunk I haven't done yet. Right. So, Because um, the left hands have been pretty strong. Yeah, it's been pretty clean, but um, if I get a, any type of fast break, I'm going to try to pull out something that no one's seen me do this year. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Dwayne Detman might be your harshest critic. He's a couple lockers away from you. You can't see him on now, but he, he's not happy with the lift. That's all good. I mean, he's kind of jealous. He can't do what I can do. Oh. It, it happens. I mean, Boys. <laughs> And obviously, right, a, 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 that's, really enough. that's enough for you. That's enough. Good. Obviously, a very happy locker room right now. What positivity do we take up to Boston for the afternoon game on Saturday? Yeah, I mean, just the fact that we're playing together, playing a lot better than um, we were early on this year. And we're still getting better. Um, I think that's the biggest thing for us. Even if it's not uh, making a playoff this year, we're still just trying to get better for next year as well. Thanks, bro.